So this is a 5.5 inch uh, Super AMOLED Plus HD display, so it's 720p resolution, um, basically the next evolution of our uh, Super AMOLED technology. Um, great bright display, I mean obviously at 5.5 inches in HD resolution, um, 1280 by 720, um, you get lots of information on the screen. It's a little bit narrower than the original Note with a larger screen, a little bit thinner, and about the same weight with a much larger battery. So, uh, was it a 3,100 milliamp hour? 3,100 milliamp hour. So, and it's our biggest battery on any device so and far. Quad core 1.6 gigahertz processor. That's correct. It's our Exynos quad core 1.6 gigahertz. Uh, it's also got two gigs of RAM, mm -hmm. and will be available in uh, three memory configurations: 16, 32, or 64 gig. Starts when you pull out the S Pen, it actually immediately launches to. Uh, special home screen that you can customize with S Pen enabled applications. Quick Note's been updated, it's now movable all over the screen. Maximize it, minimize it, move it all over. So just hold the button, double tap the screen, brings up the S Note, and you can use that while you're doing anything else on the device. So continue to use it underneath. Take a quick note while you're on the phone. You want to make a quick note while you're on a call. The S Pen now features 1,024 levels of pressure sensitivity. So it is a lot more pressure sensitive. Let me show you here. That one. So should go with. So you can kind of see the color. We'll close that and I don't want to save it. Let me hover over the folder. It opens up, shows you a preview of what's inside that folder. For example, when I'm watching a video, I can now hover over the timeline, pop up plays back, feature introduced in the Galaxy S3. Cool thing about it, it's now resizable. Let's see if any other application running can watch a video on top of it.